Hello, everyone. Welcome to another recording today with my dear friend and business partner, Susanna Ferlanik. She is a wellness and longevity advocate, as well as a co-founder of the Seven Figure Wealth Building Network. Welcome, Susanna. Nice to see you again. Nice to see you again, Amy. Thank you for having me. Yeah. Well, I want to jump right into uh, what is the Seven Figure Wealth Building Network? Can you share more about that? Yes, I can. Yeah. So the Seven Figure Wealth Building Network was brought to fruition because there are um, a lot of entrepreneurs out there that are looking for different ways to build their wealth. And it's a great environment for them to connect with like-minded individuals, um, resources for them to create income producing assets, then they can then turn it into other, you know, just expand on that. They can take um, uh, income tax strategies and all those beautiful things that they can do to um, create a legacy for their families, create a legacy for their communities. And it's just a wonderful environment um, that they can participate in. Sounds great. Now, this is something that you formed with your husband, Rich, is that right? Yes, yes. We recently formed it out of um, just a lot of people right now in the industry, different industries um, like real estate uh, that are struggling to create the incomes that they're used to creating with in real estate. Just for example, and just the segment of the market, I'm just giving you an example. And we have worked with, you know, high net worth individuals in the past and we thought, why not offer them a vehicle, another income producing vehicle that will give them the same opportunities where they're supplementing from other, you know, a lack of because of the struggles from different industries and provide them that uh, resource for creating the high net worth. And one case study that we share often is back in the 19, I would say late 90s when we launched um, the, this particular type of business in a market, um, which was Japan. And it was we were working with a US-based company and Japan was a market that we wanted to open in a population of 180 million people. And within two years, that company, US-based, uh, became one of the fastest, if not the fastest growing US company, surpassing the likes of IBM and Coca-Cola. And out of that, the, those that were participating, uh, we created over 55 seven-figure earners, 3,000 top earners, and it was a wonderful experience for all of those in that were engaged. And we find ourselves in a very similar climate now with the econo with the economy the way it is sitting, and people are looking for opportunities. And so this is the reason why we thought, okay, let's create what we created in Japan. Let's create it for people in this market. Did I hear that right? 55 seven-figure earners back then, and now we're going to do it again? <laughs> yeah, we are going to definitely do it again. Definitely going to do it again. Amazing. I, I heard that um, the 50, now there's 50 markets open around the world, and Japan was number two. Now, there there is a new 51st uh, market opening. Can we talk a little bit about that? We were slated to um, open India in 2025. And, you know, given that Japan was 180 million population, um, the middle class alone in India is over, I would say, what, 910 million? 910 million consisting of uh, millennials and Gen Zs are all on their technology. And they are looking for um, opportunities to grow and to, you know, they face five different types of struggles when it comes to, you know, housing and real estate and, you know, saving for their kids' education, which is really important for them. So they're primed right now to um, really up level their abilities to create more economy. And we're slated to come into that country in 2025. And we're really excited about that. So it's about, I would say, the 10 times plus bigger opportunity that we had back in when we opened Japan. Yeah. I for one am very excited about that too. <laughs> and I love I love the country of India as well. So this is gonna be very exciting times between now and 2025, aren't they? 
let's go back to your seven figure wealth building network for a moment. Now, what types of individuals are you magnetizing into this group? Yeah, there's a lot of people out there looking for different opportunities. They're looking for franchises. They're looking to start up their own businesses in the internet type business space. And what they're struggling with is that there's a huge learning curve. You know, they say 90% of businesses fail. And the ones who end up succeeding have gone through six, seven, eight iterations of businesses before they find their footing. And um, why businesses fail is that they lack experience and they also lack a system. Um, so this is why franchises, people get into franchises because franchises have a system, they have brand recognition. You know, if they get a good location, they can have traffic coming into their um, place of business. However, it's a seven, it's a hundred thousand to a seven figure investment for capital to get into a franchise. And then even then they don't see profitability for quite some time. And so what we had done is created us um, a digital based franchise like, I would say with a quote, franchise like business where we um, target uh, sectors of the economy where we funnel or create these distribution channels that have a system without all the headaches of and the capital investment and all the headaches of having employees. I had a friend who um, who invested into 13 subways and because he was going after um, you know wealth, he wanted to build a legacy for him and his family. However, what he ended up with, what he called was a daycare, adult daycare center. <laughs> so he was dealing with the personalities that are involved with all of that. So with um, with our business, we have a digital type franchise like virtual like with a system that produces the output of what franchises would without all of the risk, without all the debt, without all of all the capital investment, with all of, all of those things that are um, that normally has to be dealt with. So our partner handles all of that. And what we we do is we go out there and we have a system that we teach other people to do that they can have that type of leverage to create wealth for themselves and their family. Wonderful. And you and your husband both have what, a combined 50 years of experience. One years for me, over 30 for my husband. So 50, 50 years experience, we say. And um, yeah, we with in this, and it's in direct sales. So We've mastered the direct sales um, distribution, you know, the system creating, um, you know, business. And we absolutely love it because one of the things we're finding, because we've looked at other, you know, um, possibilities in the internet business space. And what we have found so far, and maybe it does exist, I just haven't found it yet. When people are leered into this concept of making ten thousand dollars a month in internet bill start your own internet build a youtube channel and all of those things it does sound very enticing to the average person until you start to look underneath the hood and you have to find that there's a massive learning curve you don't you have to develop your own digital goods and services you have to service your customers you have to understand marketing and sales you have to build your um, own systems. You have to understand technology unless you have the means to hire the people that can do that. There's up, there's capital investments involved. So it's a lot more that people think than just getting involved into a, a digital business opportunity. It's a lot harder. And they say, I even looked up chat GPT. It's like, what are the average success rate of startups? And they said 90% of the um, which is, you know, which is, which is common, which is understandable because it's not until that person has quite, you know, has invested in resources like mentorship and education to help them develop themselves to, to build a, a solid income producing business. And that takes a little while. Yes. And I like to see your, your history of success as well. 
with over 50 years combined together, you and your husband, and also the 55 seven-figure earners that you've helped empower over the years, as well as, I think you said over 3,000, what was the, the number earners. you said? Top, Top earners. Yeah. And so I, I can tell, and I, I've experienced this with you since 2009, how much you invest in education and system and, and mentorship with everyone. I wouldn't do anything without two things. A system. So when you put input, you know the output is and leverage. So, I, you know, one of the concepts of leverage is, is something I, I, I learned early on in my career, which I came to find after graduating from college and starting to work for a nine to five job. I never understood the concept of leverage until I remember reading the book from Robert Kiyosaki about you know, what the wealthy mindset do versus the people that are poor based on his experience with his poor dad and rich dad. And that blew me away. And there's so many beautiful opportunities out there that have leverage. And this is how the wealth, you know, wealthy think. They invest, they build something once or they invest into something once and the output is 10 times what they put in. Whereas the employee, their output is one to one. So they work a nine to five job, 40 hours a week, they get paid per hour, you know, so their output, they're very limited to what they're able to create until they burst out of that mental bubble and they go after different ways to where they put in, invest into something with their time or, or money and their output is 10 times of that investment. Because how else will they get ahead doing that same routine over and over again, right? When you step back and look at it. it there's no way you can get ahead. There's no way you're, it, it, we only have so much time in the day, right? So how do we leverage that time to create, you know, we gotta really take a hard look at how we're using our time and how we're investing our time and where we're investing that time to create more. So with, you know, with our system, we've built it in such a way that, you know, you build something once and the output is 10 times what you, you, uh, you put in. So you're getting to those six figures, the seven figures, um, op you know, uh, uh, opportunities. Beautiful. Now, how, if someone's listening here in our audience and they said, well, this sounds really interesting. I'm, I'm resonating with what you're saying. Maybe they do want to get out of the nine to five rat race that they can never get ahead in, or they're an entrepreneur or just someone, a visionary that's thinking, yeah, what I'm hearing right now makes a lot of sense. I'd like to learn more about the seven figure uh, wealth building network. How will, how can they learn more about this and maybe even potentially join and be, become a, you know, a business builder and a, and a mentee of you, yours? Well, it is a selective process. So not everybody um, is really qualified to participate. This is a, this takes a really high level of uh, consciousness, love, high level of thinking. It takes um, a different level of like commitment versus someone who just wants to make some part-time income and supplemental income. There's opportunities in abundance for people that want to do that. This is for someone who's committed to their goals. They have a vision and they have clarity. And when we come in and it was, we'll just talk with them and see if they qualify and then we'll plug them into how the system works. And then we work with them together. we work very closely with the people that we mentor and because we know what it takes based on the case studies we have done in the past. Well, this is so exciting. This is going to help many people's lives. Whether somebody wants to come in and, you know, create supplemental income, which is wonderful. I know that there is there's a, a level for them to come in and use utilize the system that you've created and, and all the resources. People that want to replace all of their income or maybe a mortgage payment. People that are coming in saying, I really want to go for the legacy wealth, right? The seven figure plus. You know, it is, it, it is a lot of activity. It's a lot of, it's, 
you know, the person that comes in and says, I, I, my hopes are to make an extra thousand, five thousand dollars a month. We have a, a system for that, that they can run with, they can follow, they can get mentored in. For those that say, okay, no, I, I really want to think bigger. I'm thinking bigger, more. I want more for my life, my family. Um, you know, I'm, I'm used to the, you know, six figures or the five figure incomes that I'm not getting right now because something's happening in the economy where I'm getting impacted. So we come in and say, well, let's take a look at that. Let's take a look how we can work together and how this would work for you. And then if they, if it's a match, it has to be a match, then we'll run together. Yeah, so there's um, so there's a gentleman that I remember, you know, that worked with our partner that we work with right now. Who's the our company we work with is 40 years old. They're top in their industry. They're on, publicly traded on the New York Stock Exchange. And when they were opening up Japan, this gentleman that uh, came in to work with this company was a multimillionaire, self-made man already. And he saw the opportunity for the marketplace and he saw, okay, I, we can create a system here where we can empower thousands of people to participate in the launch of a marketplace that impacted themselves and their families and you know, provided an opportunity. It was during a time where Japan was going through a, a recession. A lot of people were losing their jobs and they were trying to figure out how to supplement their job income. And the promise was very clear. You can work with a company that's gonna provide you the environment and the support to uh, subsidize or supplement that income and even help you get to other levels where you call it CEO income without having all the headaches and all of the risk and debt and overhead that you would normally have to um, burden yourself with running a regular business. And so he came in and was one of the most um, successful individuals that I'd ever obs uh, observed. And he impacted in just um, a lot of thousands and thousands of families were impacted by this in a very positive way. What's exciting, thank you for sharing that, is now you are re-implementing this in your, your, you know, with everything going on right now in our economy. And once again, like in Japan back then, people were looking for more opportunities or starting over. Or, um, maybe the, they, they launched some of their own endeavors that did not work out. Um, You'd mentioned earlier today about the real estate market changing a lot as well. So there's a lot changing and people are open and looking for, for real opportunities at this time. There, there's the economies that are changing. I, I mean, the inflation has gone up 50%. Cost of goods, the cost of groceries itself have gone 50% increase. Um, the tech, high tech market industry is laying off thousands of people every month. I live in um, in Santa Cruz, California, and I'm literally 30 minutes from high tech where Apple is and Facebook and Google. And there are people that are struggling. There are people struggling right now. So, but there's out of the thousand people that are struggling about 5%, one to 5% probably would qualify to work, I could work with because they're ready, they're ready to slay their financial dragon. They're ready, they're sick and tired of being sick and tired, and they're ready to slay the financial dragon. They may have the, the readiness and the commitment. What they need is a little bit of mentorship uh, and support and guidance to say, okay, let's navigate through this together and I'll help you do it, but you do it. <laughs> we'll help, but you do it. And we'll show them how, and we can show them how to succeed. In, a, in an environment like this.